Hi, Garrett again with DIY PBX. Welcome back. This is video 15. In the next couple of minutes, you're going to learn how to set up your call detail records on your DIY PBX. Here's Kent, our head trainer, with the step by step. Kent from DIYPBX.com. I'm going to talk to you about the CDR modules inside of your PBX. Uh, you have two options uh, for CDR modules you have the Astronic. CDR reports and you have a module just called CDR reports. I want to start with the Astronic CDR reports. It's much more about data. Uh, you can drill down and see who answered what and how often and you know how much time were they busy. Prints out some nice graphs. It's great for showing to uh, like a boss, somebody for accountability uh, as far as what's going on. You can tell how many calls per hour. You know what is your busiest thing. Great for those types of little reports to people. And you've got your CDR report module. In here, uh, you can really drill down to an individual call and uh, get calls you know, based on what day, at what time were they called. You can drill down by any of these things. They're very specific. Obviously, I've only been using this today, so we can just kind of get this right now. Um, you can see in here that I just got a list of all the calls that I made today and, and from who and where. And um, it was interesting. Uh, somebody was calling me from Bethlehem, PA on a wrong number uh, during this time. But if you had a recording, you would have two links here. One to play it, one to download uh, the call. So this is where you could go to get your call recordings. And the download one's real nice. You just download it to your computer and you uh, play it on whatever player you have on your computer. The play in the browser link um, doesn't work with the most recent release of Chrome or Firefox. Now we have a fix for that we'll put up at some point in time. Uh, but you can still play inside of IE. And uh, you can just listen to it right there. But it, the download works just fine. You download the recording and then you can play it back and listen to your recording. As far as the other things inside the CDR, you can export to a CSV, which is kind of nice. Uh, you can make some nice little graphs. You can change the amount of results that you get back. And uh, it's important to note that these are very specific. Um, the default is that it contains uh, the information, but you also, or I'm sorry, begins with, but you also have contains, ends with, and exactly. So you can change the data that you want and you can even do not so is not this caller ID that you want to look at so very granular uh, very powerful reporting and you also have the other one too for a quick overview so make sure that you make use of these so you know what's going on in your phone system and uh, like I said this is also very handy for getting to your recordings from this nice GUI thanks for sticking around to the end and watching the entire video Remember, you can find a complete transcript of this video at DIYPBX.com along with our complete catalog of DIY PBX setup videos. Thanks again for watching and good luck.